Okay guys, let's take a look at our second swing tip of the day and we're going to talk about the shaft, the plane it works on and how to shallow out this golf club on the down move. Okay, there's two distinct moves that players often make and they are this. The first one moves up nicely, sets on the board and if it shallows out it's going to turn a little bit sideways and this shaft is across my bicep in the picture. If I'm over the top and I start with my upper body, I would have this type of motion where the club head immediately comes off the board. So this new board this year is to help you learn how to allow the club to drag down. And you hear that sound, that sound of dragging, which causes this shaft again to turn a little more sideways. So frankly, it's under that plane slightly on the down move. It's a rerouting of the club. Think of Jim Fury. Up, loops, moves into the ball. Once we move through the ball, the club head now turns left and it comes out on the green pylon. That's well left of the swing. The, the club does not travel down line indefinitely. It definitely turns to the left, okay? The club head, once it strikes the ball, it's time to get going up the plane on the left side. That's virtually impossible to do unless you turn into the shot. Okay, you have to turn your shoulders and hips into the shot after this occurs. This is separation. The club's falling, starting to turn into it. We call that cover. Covering the ball, club swings up the whole left. That's our down.